What is up everyone, this is Mogam here, and today I want to show you how to fix the PlayStation 4 error code SU-35931-1. <laughs> or update data of system software is partially corrupted. So this kind of error happens when you're trying to like basically update your system software or the system software updated and this error is kind of coming up and you're basically kind of like, all right, what the hell do I do? <laughs> so basically what you're gonna do is this is usually happening due to some like network instability of basically when it's trying to download, it's not accurately being downloaded. There's some issues happening from a network error, network side of things, it's not fully accurately downloading. So there's a couple of things you can do. So first thing is obviously delete the update file that may be downloaded or be currently downloading in the in your notifications. You'll see it there. You'll like you'll see like a download thing there. Just basically press the options button and essentially just delete it from there. Once you kind of do that, you want to go to <laughs> settings and in account management actually first before that you want to go to network and i want you to actually change your network access so you want to go to setup network connection preferably if you can make a lan cable make it but that's basically the ethernet cable if you can if it's wi-fi that's fine but preferably do that once you're there make sure to do custom for both uh, do automatic for ip and d d do not specify for dac for the dns we're doing manual here and we're going to change this to 1.1.1.1 for primary and secondary is going to be 1.0.0.1 .1. basically going to do next automatic here do not use here and we're going to let it basically test the internet connection everything should successfully work you should not see any problems here and you should see a decent internet a download and upload speed which is what you want once you kind of do those things you actually want to go to account management you want to actually ensure your primary playstation 4 user so you want to kind of do that you want to restore your license all over here just to make sure everything's kind of good to go from this perspective you're like covering all your bases and i've done like a little bit of research that this does end up helping you basically resolve this issue and then you want to essentially basically download the software system update so you want to go find system software update find it essentially it, if you obviously don't have it it'll tell you but you want to just kind of update it from here if for some reason this doesn't work i'll leave a link in the description below on how to update your system via the usb because that is the next method but this most likely will help you resolve your issue and you should be good to go um so yeah that's basically it that is how you fix this error if you guys overall have any comments questions concerns just let me know in the comment section below more than happy to help you guys out if you guys overall like this video please smash that like button helps a lot and if you guys are new to the channel make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell on that mugging out